Hi everyone, Luxante here and in this video I'm going to talk about two different types of licenses you might encounter while creating your commercial product. Here's a little disclaimer, I am not a lawyer, I am a surface pattern designer and an artist and I have uh, more than 8 years experience in licensing artwork for commercial purposes and I get asked a lot by my customers about these two different types of uh, art licenses. This is all based on my own experience. For more information and legal advice, please contact a lawyer. A license is uh, written in a legal document called contract uh, in between the two parties, a person who is licensing art, an artist, the creator of that artwork, and a person who is licensing art for his or her purposes. Different purposes and different types of licenses, uh, and you can negotiate a specific type of license, but in this video I'm going to discuss two types of licenses, exclusive license versus non-exclusive license. So let's get started. Exclusive license is a transfer of rights from the artist to you, the licensee, to create and manufacture your products using the artwork. Uh, in this case, only you and you alone will be able to use this product uh, depending on um, whether there is a time-bound license or not. So, the sometimes exclusive license is time-bound, so for example, you can, be, you can have um, the exclusive right for manufacturing of this product for three years or five years and in many cases the exclusive license does not have a time restriction so you can re reproduce your products with this artwork for uh, any, num any amount of time. Even the artist does not get the right to use this product anymore and uh, in his uh, purposes but in my contract I always add the statement that I would like to reuse use this um, artwork for promotional purposes that for example I, I may post this picture in my portfolio or on my social media opposite end there is a non-exclusive license and this license means that you also get the right to reproduce this artwork on your products for commercial purpose resale but the artist can license this uh, artwork to other people and other companies other businesses you can get a specific custom non-exclusive license by discussing uh, with your artist uh, or case by case which use you need for your products in both of these cases you cannot use the artwork to distribute it for free or to sell it on your uh, own website as a digital file. Um, uh, for this you need an additional license if you want to use it for these purposes. In my own work I use both types of these licenses with my freelance customers and I uh, license my repeat uh, patterns for different types of products. So um, that really depends upon the case. So this is my explanation of these two types of licenses for uh, licensing artwork. And uh, please, if you have any questions, put them down in the comment section. And uh, if you have any experience with licensing uh, artwork, please let us know and share your experience in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Bye.